Okay. So, I'm just sitting out front waiting for my hedges to finish getting watered, and I find myself with a moment of free time. And as I'm sure you know, uh, I've been kind of eclipse crazy ever since I found out that 2017 was going to be my, my chance at last to get to see a total solar eclipse. Uh, total solar eclipses are quite rare, uh, especially if you don't plan on moving out uh, around a lot, but um, you know, on average they happen something like every eight years or something like that. Anyway, um, they sell online eclipse glasses, which don't look very good at all, so I figured I'd um, take the initiative and make some of my own. These are uh, dirt cheap welding goggles. Um, you can find these online, Amazon and eBay for less than 10 bucks often enough. And they're, they're pretty great because um, the, the lenses are replaceable. Um, unlike with most pieces of, of like costume welding goggles, like these are actually designed to serve a, a purpose. But you're going to need to replace the, the lenses here because the, they're, they're just not dark enough for uh, staring at the sun, which is uh, what I intend to do. Uh, now I've researched this and determined that the, the degree of shade that you're going to need is, uh, is uh, shade 14. Shade 14, um, it's just a, it's a welding manufacturer standard. I don't know what the 14 actually stands for, but um, all we gotta do is um, buy two objects, this replacement lens and this set of welding goggles is about uh, 12 bucks altogether. And uh, best part about it is you don't need tools to make this work. Um, now I'm only making this video because it's kind of counterintuitive how to replace these lenses. Um, you would think that it's self-explanatory. It pretty, it pretty much is. Um, I just had to take a shot in the dark and like nearly break one of my lenses on the other pair of goggles that I got. But this is um, it's pretty easy. Uh, these lens packs, this particular ma manufacturer, comes with um, one lens only. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn uh, one of these uh, goggle sets into a sun viewing lens and the other just a, a general uh, like welding purpose <laughs> darkness. Uh, I'm probably going to end up taping over one side so you don't accidentally stare at the sun. Um, so, um, so, demo. Uh, I'm going to choose my left side uh, when worn uh, because that's my good eye, my best eye, and I want to keep it that way. Uh, so I'm going to replace the lens on the left side. Now to do that, um, you kind of have to force upward pressure um, from the front side of the mask when closed. So you just, you open that sucker up and then uh, with both sets of four fingers, you just kind of force the cap toward you in a wiggling motion and hope that it was manufactured in the same way as the goggles that I experimented on just recently. There we go, there was a little pop there. Now, what you should feel now is the lens, you can kind of hear it, it's a little loose. Um, just give that another pop on the other side, and this ring now should start to rotate freely, whereas the other ring will not. Uh, so after you've forced the lens uh, upward, uh, just unscrew this counterclockwise, set that there, take out. The, the 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 factory lens keep the plastic retention lens in place this this you can get rid of uh, that's nothing and uh, inside the box of 
the 14 degree shade lens, find a very sharp piece of dark green glass. And it doesn't look like you can see through it or anything like that, but rest assured you can when you're staring at the sun. It's marked with a 14 here, so you can't possibly forget. I'm gonna leave that there. You could remove it if you wanted to, but um, I kind of like it. So I'm gonna make the 14 face outward. Grab this plastic clip and just screw that sucker back in there, finger tight. Now, it shouldn't have any play at all, so I'm just gonna give it another little half twist and you're done. Close that sucker up and uh, look into the sun. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you can see anything. I sure as heck can't. But um, it's uh, it's actually pretty effective. Um, anyway, uh, that was that. And uh, well, <laughs> I don't make a lot of tutorial videos. I only made this one because I couldn't find anything on the internet that showed you how to replace these uh, these cheapo goggle lenses. But it's uh, simple enough. Anyway, uh, happy eclipse hunting, and I'll see you around.